Scientific experts are calling the president's new environmental policy a disaster, and many believe it will have devastating effects in the near future. Well, it's called chlorpyrifos, and several major studies have found it to inhibit the brain and development of children. The EPA actually banned it from home use in 2000, citing these dangers, but it was still permitted to be sprayed on farms. The fact that the EPA continues to allow it to be used has led me to believe that current EPA has little desire to protect American citizens or the environment, all because the makers of the pesticide have strong connections financially to the commander-in-chief. More and more reports are surfacing of children encountering dangerous side effects as a result of the clopyrifos, with many people describing cases of vomiting, loss of memory, and even death. Citizens are encouraged to stay clear of farms known to use the product, and parents are advised to bring their children to the hospital if any of these symptoms arise. A growing trend of attacks have thousands of Americans worried, as throughout the West Coast there have been reports of children in hospitals fighting their doctors, <laughs> nurses, and even their parents. These attacks appear to be isolated incidents, but have since become more and more common. Whoa, 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 listen, listen, listen. Right, I'm not trying to hurt anybody, right? I'm just, I'm just trying to get medicine for my daughter. Zombie, that's what she is. That's what this is. A real life zombie. No, 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 no. She's sick, all right? She's sick. She just needs medicine. But she needs to be taken out back with a shotgun. We cannot risk an outbreak of this sickness, and it continues to spread. Listen, just put down the gun, all right? No one needs to get hurt, all right? No one needs to get hurt. Just put down the gun, and I'll be on my way. If we don't do something, this is the end. Yeah.